、私は販売店の皆様がエナジックのコンセプトである3つの健康すなわち、えー、体の健康経済の健康心の健康をより多くのお客様に伝えていただいていることに対して深く感謝を申し上げますさて正しい情報の伝達はどのビジネスにおいても最も重要な事項の一つです情報を正しく伝達することでお客様との間に信頼関係が生まれます信頼関係が出来上がると販売が促進されます販売の促進は経済の健康につながりますさて本コンプライアンス DVD は販売店の皆様にとって重要な情報を含んでいますどうか皆様が販売の現場で目標を達成するための資料として活用されることを望みます Drinking Kengen water is one of the most powerful ways to improve your health and well-being. In its endeavor to keep spreading the essentials of true health around the world, Enagic is also committed to protecting the livelihood of its distributors. As Enagic is a worldwide business, it's important to understand as a distributor that there are specific rules that must be followed while selling any Enagic product to the public. At Enagic, it's not our intention to police your actions while working with us as distributors. In fact, the purpose of this video is to do the opposite by clearly stating some of the more important rules and regulations that Enagic and its distributors are required to adhere to by law. That way, you'll be aware of what is allowed and what is not. While Enagic doesn't make all of the rules, we believe that they were set up to ultimately protect ourselves as well as our distributors, keeping unsafe products and unfair business practices out of the marketplace. It is important for you to note that the topics discussed in this presentation are just some of the more key aspects of compliance as an Enagic distributor. We urge you also refer to the Enagic website to download the complete list of policies and procedures. Here's a list now of the topics that will be covered in this video. Income claims, changing prices, selling water, use of the Enagic logo, and medical claims. We sincerely hope that these points will be clearly explained and that they will aid you in achieving and maintaining success as one of our valued and agic distributors. Let's begin. First up is income claims. In agic's policies and procedures section states that each distributor is encouraged to set up their own method of sale so long as they comply with the policies and the procedures of the company. The policies and procedures state that no income claims, income projections, income representation, or revealing of commission checks, which is also known as check waiving, may be made to prospective distributors. Any false, deceptive, or misleading claims regarding the opportunity or product and services are prohibited. The company believes firmly that the income potential is great enough to be highly attractive in reality without resorting to artificial and unrealistic projections. You may ask why, as a distributor, are you not allowed to tell other prospective distributors about how much money you make selling Enagic's products? According to Jeff Babiner, one of Enagic's key legal counselors, You're offering an opportunity to thousands and millions of individuals who are going to be doing this part-time. And they're amateurs. They're not professional salespeople. They're not manufacturers. Representatives are not going to be employed by the company. And therefore, those people are viewed as vulnerable, uh, and they're viewed as the purchaser of an opportunity. And that's why it's regulated as by a consumer protection statute to protect them, uh, an amateur who is about to be involved in, in a business opportunity. Mr. Babner also stated that this behavior is predatory and unethical, and we would much rather that the environment within our distribution network be nurturing and supportive in nature. Enagic strongly encourages you to explain how our compensation plan works to prospective distributors. For more details about how the system works, please refer to our compensation DVD. Also, when Enagic announces average incomes of their distributors, you may then use that figure and your personal income for recruiting purposes. Next is changing prices. It must be absolutely clear that Enagic sets the prices that the various units will be sold for. 
The company offers no sales, no discounts, or any other concessions, and the distributor is not permitted to do so either. It is important to know that even though you are selling a unit to a customer, that customer is still actually buying the unit from Inagic, not from you. In addition, the sale of Enagic's products over the internet by a registered distributor is strictly prohibited. Where distributors basically say, we're selling the product and then they advertise we're going to give a rebate to, the, to you, the consumer, for buying it. And effectively what the, the distributor is doing at that point is they're really changing the price of the product. We don't sell the units to distributors who then are like wholesalers who then resell it. We basically, our distributors assist in securing orders for us. They come to the company. Putting the legal aspects aside for just a moment, let's take a look at this from a business perspective. If a distributor lowers the price of a unit and other potential buyers catch on, they may be looking for a discount as well. And before long, the distributors might feel compelled to lower their prices to compete with each other. If that becomes commonplace within our network of distributors, then profits will shrink for everybody, and we would all suffer the consequences. We hope that you appreciate that the prohibition of changing prices has been implemented to maintain healthy profit margins, which is something we can all benefit from. Next, selling water. Selling bottled Kengen water, or any other water in any other form produced from an Enagic machine, is strictly prohibited. There are two basic reasons why this action is not allowed. One is regulatory, the other is safety. According to Mitch Goldstein, an FDA expert and consultant to Enagic, uh, from a regulatory standpoint, FDA views water as a food. You may not think of it that way, uh, but it is a food, and you'll notice when you buy bottled water in the store, it has a nutrition label. And anybody who is selling a food uh, must manufacture that food in a registered food facility. <clears throat> so unless you want to turn your kitchen into a registered and licensed FDA facility subject to FDA inspection, it's best not to, it's best to follow this uh, very important prohibition. The main reason why the FDA is so strict about the production and sale of food, or in this case water, is due to the possible health hazards that could arise. Improper bottling methods can cause harmful bacteria to taint the water, causing illness or worse. As an adjunct guards their reputation as an organization that creates products that promote healthy lifestyles, any violation of this section will constitute grounds for commission suspension and or eventual termination of distributor status. Next, the use of the Enagic logo. The company will not permit the use of its copyrights, designs, logos, trade names, trademarks, and etc. without its prior written permission. This includes any written, printed, recorded, or any other materials involving advertising, promoting, or describing Enagic's products or services and marketing programs. All material that has not been copyrighted and supplied by an adjunct must first be submitted to the company for approval in writing before being disseminated, published, or displayed. In all cases, any reference that distributors make to themselves must clearly state the distributor's independent status. For example, on a brochure or a business card under your name, it would say something like independent distributor rather than in adjunct representative. In addition, when using the registered trademark, such as an Enagic logo and phrase Kangen Water, you must print the registered trademark symbol. Let's take a look at some examples of improper and proper uses of the logo. This first brochure is missing a registered trademark next to the logo. The next example used a registered trademark to the right of the Enagic logo but is missing a registered trademark next to the Kangen water. This brochure is correct. It has the official Enagic logo and slogan with registered trademark correctly placed. This is also correct too as Kangen water is registered by Enagic. Now the brochure is at approvable status and is ready to go. 
It's also recommended that you include a disclaimer in order to further increase your credibility. Here are two examples of added disclaimers on an Enagic brochure. One, when using the term Kenyan Water, you should print Kenyan Water is a registered trademark of Enagic USA at the bottom. And two, when designing marketing material, you should also print this advertisement was created, then insert your name, an independent distributor of an adjunct. Failure to follow any of the guidelines that have just been described in this section is a direct violation of an adjunct's policies concerning the display and distribution of any marketing and promotional materials. Keeping that in mind, we highly encourage you to hold off on any printing materials in bulk until the prototype that you send to an adjunct has been approved. This is going to save you a lot of time and money wasted on unusable materials in the event that your materials are not approved. Once your materials have been approved, however, we gladly encourage you to use your promotional materials as often as you choose. Next, medical claims. According to Enagic's policies and procedures, distributors are prohibited from using in all of their marketing materials and promotion any descriptions that are regarded as health or medical claims stating that Kangen water may do any of the following. Alleviate, cure, diagnose, prevent, relieve or treat any medical condition, disease, ailment or melody. This is very important to understand as making such claims is against the law. Distributors are prohibited from making even relative mundane structures or functional claims such as Kengen water carries fuel and oxygen more efficiently to the cell or detoxifies the colon, etc. If you go beyond the concept formally in publication and advertising of uh, uh, indicating diseases, use this for cancer, use this for Alzheimer's disease, use this for fibromyalgia, use this for your skin cancer. When, you, when that is done, particularly in an anecdotal way, particularly with pictures of shrunken you know, tumors and things like that, um, you are, or, the, or the, those who are doing that, are endangering the franchise of the company and they're endangering the livelihood of all the other distributors who are selling uh, the product. Let's take a look at some good and some bad examples of medical claims in advertising and promotional materials. As stated earlier, making such claims that Kenyan water will cure or alleviate any of these diseases and ailments is against the law and is not permitted. Again, this brochure is considered by the FDA to be a structural function claim. So if you say uh, this water is good for glaucoma, for diabetes, for any medical or therapeutic claim. It has the possibility of turning a general consumer product into a medical device. The water could be viewed or classified as a drug. This brochure exhibits testimonials from people who claim that drinking Kengen water cured or alleviated the various health issues stated. And while that may be true, it is still unlawful to use testimonials like these with such claims as they have not been actually proven to be true. Testimonials are very effective ways of impressing the customers, but at the same time, you need to be very careful when using testimonials. Here are a few things that you need to be careful of when using a testimonial. Number one, avoid stating that your results are typical results for everyone. Number two, Avoid testifying in public or in front of large audiences. Number three, do not talk about anybody else's testimony. And lastly, do not record your own testimony on any kind of recording device for use in any form of media. More general claims about Enagix products that don't indicate specific ailments and diseases are definitely allowed and encouraged. A few examples of acceptable claims about Kengen water include attaining a sound mind, body, and spirit basic hydration, and inner peace. These are all things that we believe are fundamental benefits of consuming Kangen water produced by Enagix machines. Here are a few examples of properly stated claims or promises pertaining to Kangen water. These examples imply that drinking Kangen water will enhance your well-being and can serve as a useful product in everyday use. They do not, however, make any claims or promises that it will cure any ailment or illness. Common wording that is acceptable could also include the following. Feel whole again, drink to your health, or achieve a healthy lifestyle. 
Statements like these are general, and they don't specify exact ways Kenyan water will benefit you in a medicinal manner. Change your water, change your life. That's the official slogan registered to an adjunct. So, if you're going to use this slogan, you will need to add the trademark documentation, and you will still need permission from an adjunct to use it. We kindly request that you respect the rules pertaining to unlawful medical claims. Again, this is for the safety of the customer as well as the protective measure for all of our valued distributors. Hello, my name is Horst Siegfried Filzer. I've spent my majority of my life as a surgeon. I graduated from Harvard Medical School in the 60s. I have been a practicing vascular surgeon, department chairman, and educator throughout my life. And I have now uh, been asked to give some consultations to the Inagi Company on medical matters. This is important for distributors because company policy suggests strongly that medical advice not be given by distributors. The reason for this is that there are a number of conditions in which the ingestion of water of any kind or liquid of any kind must be closely monitored and actual harm can result by excessive ingestion of fluids. We've had experience that uh, untowards things have happened and it is therefore best not to give any advice and to refer the prospect to their own physician. If distributors have any questions about gray areas where they might need some specific medical advice, they can feel free to call the Enagic call center and I will get in touch with them and discuss the issue with them personally. Thank you very much. We would like to thank you for taking time out to review some of the crucial policies that have been put into place for everybody's protection. These rules are set so that distributors will be able to succeed in a fair market. Please spread these important pieces of information to all of your prospective distributors as it will help them prosper as well. Once again, the topics in this video are only a few of the important topics that you are required to become familiar with as an Enagic distributor. Please download and review the complete list of Enagic's policies and procedures from our official website at www.enagic.com. And as the information may change in the future, it is important to regularly check with Enagic and your distribution teams for any important updates. We want to thank you for taking the time to review this important information, and we hope that you find it helpful and valuable as one of our many respected Enagic distributors. And if you have any questions at all regarding specific details about our policies, please feel free to contact us at 1-866-261-9500 or email us at compliance at